everybody welcome back to our channel if you're new here i am owls and i've been posting very little lately honestly it's been very chaotic as you can tell it's december it's the holidays time i just finished my first semester and that was insane my family also came over for a little bit and they left and now they're coming back on friday and today it snowed for the first time of the season and i have never seen snow like that like look at that it's so pretty it's insane i've only seen snow a handful of times in my life so we just went for a little walk and i don't know it was so pretty i'll put a couple pictures here um it was amazing but anyways i am on school break now and i'm still working uh, my part-time job and my family's coming back so i think i'm gonna do a little week in the life to kind of motivate myself to do different things and to get out and walk and maybe we can find some fun activities to do but um yeah i'm gonna do it from today that's monday until saturday and saturday ends with a day in cambridge so that's gonna be the little week from monday to saturday so let's get this started and we're just gonna have some coffee now and read which honestly that sounds really good right now Also, you guys, I forgot to show you what the snow looked like, and it's dark out now, so here we are. But this is, and it's already kind of melted because it hasn't snowed since the morning, but look at that, and it's so beautiful, but it's freezing. Also, I forgot to film that I actually did some baking this afternoon. I don't know if I mentioned, I mentioned that my mom and sister are coming on the weekend, but they were here last week as well. And they brought me a lot of Argentinian food, which I'm super thankful for because I honestly missed it so, so much. And I forgot to film this, but I made little alfacorcitos de maicena, which are the best thing ever. My grandma sent me, my grandparents sent me like the little, what do you call it? Like the pitas, I don't know, the two sides. I'll insert a picture here. Um, with dulce de leche, I made them today. They were so good. Harry loved them as well. So that's what I'm going to be snacking off the next couple of days. I just forgot to film it. Honestly, I started this video this morning and then I just completely forgot about it. So I apologize for that, you guys. Hopefully tomorrow will be a bit more entertaining. Um, but yeah, now I'm just watching some YouTube and I think we're just going to start a new show called SAS or something like that. So we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Good morning friends and happy Tuesday. I again apologize for filming so little yesterday but honestly it was the first day in weeks that Harry and I had had together off without doing anything at all like literally nothing so it was very exciting. We did start that show SAS Rogue Heroes I think it's called from the BBC and it is created for television by the same guy that did Peaky Blinders. So I think that is all you need to know about it. It's really good if you're into sort of action-y and it has quite a lot of comedy in it as well. So I don't know why I did that like comedy. Um, so yeah, anyways, lost my train of thought, great show. Started Tuesday, Harry just went over to work and I'm having some coffee. I'm also gonna be reading uh, Arrow Fire. This is the book that I'm on right now. It's the third one of the Throne of Glass series by Sarah J Maas. And I am absolutely loving it. I've read her other two series and I cannot recommend them enough, but this is so good. It's amazing. I think Akatar for now, her, one of her other series is still my favorite one personally, but we'll see how this goes because this is going really well. So if you really like fantasy and kind of magic and different worlds and romance, I definitely recommend this series. Um, it's so good, so yeah. That's how I'm going to spend my morning and I need to go to the supermarket today. It's going to be kind of like a reset day because during the weekend we had a wedding and we went away for the weekend. So there's kind of a lot to clean up, a lot to do around the house. So that's kind of what the day is going to look like. And then I work 6 to 11, sadly. So that's going to be what my night looks like and then i'll probably just come over for sleep but that is what today's gonna look like i also need to wrap the presents you guys christmas is in a week and a half it's in a week and a half oh my god i do have all of my christmas shopping done except i think i need to buy like some chocolates and stuff to add to the presents like why do i keep doing this what what is this anyways um so yeah, I might do that today. I might add some stuff and then we can wrap everything tomorrow. We'll see. I, I love Christmas time. I look so sleepy. I am sleepy. Okay, you guys, I changed and I'm gonna make some lunch now. And we discovered these little packets from Aldi. 
And they're so good. This is pasta and sauce with cheese, leek, and ham. It sounds so good. The other day we made mac and cheese from this same thing. It's amazing. So I'm just gonna make that, maybe watch some YouTube, and then go back to reading. Like I said, this week I'm literally gonna treat it as if I was on like school vacation. I haven't had a week like this in ages. So I'm very excited. Um, and also I get to see my mom and sister in like two days, three. I'm so excited. Hey you guys, I just wanted to give you a quick update on my day. Honestly, I've had the most relaxing day ever. I read quite a lot, watched a lot of YouTube, and it is 10 to 5 now, so I need to start getting ready for work. But it's already dark outside, and it's minus 2 degrees. It's so cold, and I have to walk there. It's gonna be freezing. So I'm kind of excited. But yeah, that'll probably be it for Tuesday because when I come back, it's 11. I eat, shower, and go straight to bed. So it's not that entertaining, really. Um, yeah, I don't know if this is gonna be an entertaining video at all because I'm really doing absolutely nothing over these days. <sighs> Guys, I don't wanna leave. <laughs> I've literally been wrapped up in a blanket all day and now I have to leave the house like look you guys that is at 5 in the afternoon dark as night <laughs> up today and he was feeling rather ill so he's been just chilling that's me what just know this is me. oh <laughs> uh so yeah happy wednesday not for harry though thanks for reminding me. <laughs> hopefully he'll feel better by the end of the day we just had some lunch and it's been a chill morning i don't work until 5 30 and today's a very short day because i work 5 30 to 8 30 so that's really cool and then i'm gonna come back and we're gonna have some soup and we're gonna keep watching that show that i told you guys we started but also i have some news because Ooh. i was gonna what soup are we having uh the good one Whoa. like the because there's one flavor that we loved most of all my grandma had sent me this little packets of soup and they are so good but there's one flavor that is just on top of all of them so we're gonna make that one mm. anyways I was gonna make this video until Saturday when things got a little interesting because we were gonna go to Cambridge but I'm gonna actually because I was gonna stop it to make a different video on Sunday because we were supposed to go into London but turns out Argentina yesterday won the game so we are in the World Cup final which is so exciting so my mom was like we're not going to London we're staying so that we can watch the game and we're gonna you know get food and do all that I don't know the ritual before a game um, so I'm gonna do this video until Sunday when we watched the World Cup final. I'm very excited, I'm very nervous. We've been so close so many times that I just hope this is the one. Anyways, uh, Argentina. so yeah, the video- Argentina. Why do you look so miserable? I am miserable. No, I am just recovering. What are we doing today? <laughs> what are we doing today? What are we doing today? We are doing some work. Mm -hmm. We are still recovering. <laughs> Not from a hangover, but from just being ill. Because it's Christmas and winter. And people get ill around that time. <laughs> I feel like you're about to pull up a book and tell a story. I wish I could. Um, and then we're going to Aldi, mm -hmm. which is always a highlight of the week. Uh, are we 80? We're getting ready for the weekend and it's going to be mental. Well, your mum and sister get here Friday, which will be mental because there's train strikes, so we don't know how they're going to get here. Saturday, I have to go to the airport to get my dad at mm -hmm. six in the morning. Mm -hmm. Crazy. <laughs> and then I have work till nine great just <laughs> and then sunday we were, were gonna go to london 
but now you're not. Yeah, so World I Cup. Am. About the train strikes, oh my goodness. My mom and sister have never, well, they only took the trains once here and we got them tickets. Or I mean, sorry, they got themselves tickets. So we're hoping, like when you get the ticket, it says that there's a little warning that there will be interrupted services, but you might get lucky. So I'm really hoping they get lucky. If not, they're gonna be stuck. I'm hoping that's not the case. Anyways, yeah, for today we are going to Aldi. I'm gonna keep on reading for a little bit. Also, I've decided, because I've seen so many TikToks about this lately, that I'm gonna do a vision board. What's gonna be 2023 like? Let's have another chill day. And I know in the beginning of this, I was like, oh, I'm gonna film to force myself to do more stuff. And I've had the most relaxing week ever. But honestly, you guys, my brain needed this week. And we've got so much planned next week is gonna be insane and also i will be vlogging next week you guys we are going to the mama mia party thing at the o2 next week so i'll definitely be doing like a little christmas in london thing which will include that and will include a day out in london so that's another video that will be coming also i forgot to tell you i have work 6 to 11 again today but it's the last day of the week that i work so i'm not too sad about it you guys, the best thing that England has to offer is cheese on toast. Oh. Yeah, you too, but cheese on toast. This is the best thing ever, and mm. I will stand by that. And it's only the way I make it as well. Yeah, it's so good. Okay, you guys, I've been doing a lot of cleaning. Um, like we said, we have some family over soon, so there's a lot to organize. Also, stocking up on some TikToks, because, again, it's going to be a busy week. Now, I'm going to be doing some Christmas wrapping. I just, yeah, it's gonna be this year a smaller Christmas presents wise, but you know, there's still some stuff to do. I wrote the Christmas cards yesterday, so I'm ready to finish it up. I just wanna have it done and ready. So yeah, let's do some wrapping. You guys, this is the first present, and this is the hardest thing I've ever done. I'll, the other day we wrapped two presents for my brother. I will insert a picture here of what that looked like. Wrapping is really hard. I'm never buying wrapping again. I'm using bags from now on. That's what I always used to do. I, was used, I used to do bags and put the little tissue paper on top. That was my sort of way of doing gifts. But this year I was like, oh my god, they have such cute like Christmas wrapping paper. Let's do it. I'm never doing this again. It looks so unneat. This is the second one, looks all right from the front and the upper bit is not too bad, but look at that, oh, it's terrible. Okay, you guys, we did it. We have presents there, bottle there, and more presents here. Honestly, I ended up looking at a TikTok on how to wrap and I used a technique that started working for me. They still don't look perfect, but they started getting progressively better. So yeah, it's a, an art, honestly, wrapping. Good morning, you guys. I literally just woke up. Happy Friday. This day, supposedly, the dates of the, sorry, the grades of the presentation come out that we had like month, a month ago. So I'm really nervous and I just went to look at the grade and we will suffer together. Honestly, I don't care. I just want to pass. It's all good. But let's see, because it's in the 16th, but I don't know if it was after a specific time or not so we'll figure it out oh it's not out so yeah it does say feedback released by the 16th which is today but it doesn't say a specific time so i'm guessing it's gonna be at some point today also you guys i woke up and i saw that audible had com commented on one of my tiktoks <laughs> like it's not even yeah i don't know honestly fangirling over audible You guys, I'm about to make lunch and I know I should make something different, but we got more of these yesterday and they're so good, so we're gonna make it. Okay, friends, I believe we had mentioned the train strikes and that my mom and sister were supposed to get on a train and my mom just texted me and they did get on a train, so they're on their way here. 
It's very exciting. Uh, I'm gonna do some extra wrapping because there was one more present to wrap. I'm heating up my coffee now, well, the milk uh, for my coffee, and yeah, I'm excited to see them. You guys, okay, got ready for the day. I mean, I'm still wearing my pajama pants. I got the grade, I passed, it's all good. Oh, I'm so excited. And I get my final paper uh, grades in a month, so it's still gonna be a while, but at least this is all right, gives me hope. And then, yeah, and I'm gonna go be my mom and sister in half an hour. I'm so excited. So we are, well, not we are not making dinner. Solisi is making dinner. Good morning friends, happy Thursday. Look at my eye bags, that is not nice. I am having some coffee, gonna have some breakfast and I need to leave the house in half an hour to meet my mom and sister because we're heading into Cambridge. So let's have breakfast. Also look at the table, um, I don't know what you call them, not tablecloths, but little table, I can't remember the name, but look at them that my mom got me. They're so cute. <laughs> Very cold. As you can see, there is snow. How are you doing, Sol? Having a good day? Yeah, it's really cold though, so I'm not having a good time. <laughs> it's like half a good time because it's very cold. But you know, we did some shopping, which is really cool. And mom, as always, she's taking pictures. <laughs> back and we're waiting for the game mom is amending one of my uh, pants very sweet of her and so see brought macarons or oh, macaroons macarons I don't know from Maybe. France I don't know so we are gonna try them or at least me yeah she's gonna try them we are gonna try I think this is the chocolate one should it be smell it there we go kind of Kind of. Mm -hmm. Anyways, that's how it looks. Let's try it. Mmm. <laughs> it's like brownie. Uh -huh. Do you want to give it a little bite? Mm. It's like fudgy brownie vibes. No? The outside part is horrifying, but the inside is good. Okay. How do we feel? Are we ready? No. <laughs> We're so nervous. It's starting, you guys. Ah, we won, you guys. Are you excited? So excited. It's been like an hour already, and the, we watched the award ceremony. We watched everything, but we cannot believe it. It was the most excruciatingly painful game in history, but we won. Thank you. 